Okay, here we have a sugar-free barbecue sauce that I whipped up using um, tomato paste, just, you know, your typical tomato paste, <clears throat> liquid smoke, a whole bunch of barbecue-style spices, which included things like, like Cajun spice and barbecue spice that have things like, uh, you know, coriander, assorted peppers, um, onion, garlic, salt, uh, chili powder, paprika, you know, all those things. You could even just throw in your own. And also, um, also a real soy sauce, like maybe a tablespoon or two of real, I have to measure it better next time, of real soy sauce, Tikoman, not that, uh, not the cheap soy sauce which has MSG in it. This is the one without MSG. It's really made from, uh, you know, it's made the real way. And uh, liquid smoke doesn't have MSG in it. Be careful because some of those smoke products have MSG. Stop making noise, Brendan. And um, so anyway, it, it was really good. I used xylitol. You could also use stevia if you wanted. Some apple cider vinegar and hot water. A little bit of hot water. It's nice and thick the way I like it. I'm trying to think if I forgot anything. I don't think so. I think that's pretty much the core ingredients. Um, this is really nice. This is with the liquid smoke. It is beautiful. It's sweet. I must have used about I don't know two or three tablespoons, or maybe four of xylitol. Next time I'll measure it out better. This was just a. I, I was just experimenting. I threw it together. It tastes great. My son keeps coming in here to try to taste it. I tell him it's for the ribs I'm making. Um, so uh, I'll try to measure it out better next time. Or maybe I should just keep it a secret. Maybe I should market this stuff for diabetics and people watching their weight. It's awesome. Um, I don't know how tomato paste would be. I mean, it doesn't really have sugars in it. Three grams of sugars in tomato paste. Is that okay for diabetics? Someone let me know. Um, so, it's awesome. Hope you like that idea. This is more for P3, obviously. You can't have ribs on... Uh, on uh, P2, but you could probably put a little bit of this on a little bit of steak or something in P2 and get away with it. Um, let me know what you think. Bye.